And in terms of calculations, hand calculations, what is most important to us or what are the main calculations that we do is related to head of the pump, we do the NPSH of the pump, and we do the power estimation of the pump or the shaft power for the, the pump. Here, uh, in the, this is the GPSA electronic data book. You will see that the NPSH available can be calculated in two ways. One of the ways is taking into consideration the pressure and minus vapor pressure. You will use the specific gravity of the fluid and also the velocity at the nozzle of the pump. Uh, and be attention about that because you will see what it, how it influences in the ice pan high seas. And we can use the, the pressure in the suction of the pump, the vapor pressure also, and specific gravity, and consider the losses that you have in your, your pipe system at the suction of the pump. And the 2.31 or 2.31 is because it is not in international standards in it is not international units okay it is feet psi so etc so because of that we have this uh, equation here but for the head calculation what do you use is this uh, equation here it takes into account the pressure at the discharge of the pump the suction of the pump and there is the elevation related to the center line as we have seen in the, in the schematics that we just uh, uh, did to us. And this, this picture here, you can download from my in-process Telegram channel. I have posted it a long time ago there, and I will repost in order that it's easier to you to download it. Okay, so we need the equations for head, we need the equations for NPSH available, and there, are, there is also an equation for, for pump power, but I will not show, uh, show to you this equation uh, because it's not the purpose here.